the... What are you doing? Making messes? Uh, you are? You're making messes? Oh my goodness. You got your ball cut out. And, oh my lord. Did you do all this? Did you do all this? You got baby sharks? Yeah. Ooh, be careful. I'm gonna see. That's why daddy cleared all this up so that we wouldn't be tripping all over your stuff. Yeah, but you're tripping all over it anyway because you pull it all on now. <laughs> pull it on out while we're watching cars. Yeah, is this a. Uh, ooh, be careful. Ooh, what you got? <gasps> the daddy shark and grandpa shark. What? RBG Studios. <sighs> so, yeah, did you see? There goes the boy going to work. You know what I mean? <laughs> Stay night at his grandparents. Daddy got some cleaning done. Here's a picture of the before. Now nah, you just saw the after. At least I got to enjoy a clean living room for like a solid day. That was nice. That was nice. Dancing, man. Getting it. I also did another silly thing that I thought I would never do, guys. I done signed up and joined TikTok and have already uploaded quite a few videos. It's a little more fun than I thought it would be, but uh, my passion lives with the vlogging and filmmaking. But I'm, I guess might as well have some fun with it. I mean, all I used to do was complain about the app and how silly it was, but uh, I mean, complaining does us no good now, does it? Ain't gonna get us nowhere. Not that I'm trying to hop on the bandwagon and become a TikToker, but it's, it's an extra platform to promote. Dust has gotten a kick out of some of the videos, but here's a couple videos for you guys just to give you an idea. That's the most powerful trank gun on the market. Huh, got her in Mexico. Cool. Yeah, it is cool. They say it could puncture the skin of a rhino from a hundred... <laughs> I like playing with myself. I play with myself all day long. <laughs> what? So you guys can see a lot of stuff if you're not following me on the social medias and only YouTube or vice versa or whatever. You're missing out because every platform I put up different things, so it's not all the same. I guess follow this YouTubing TikToker. Now you see me. Now you don't. <laughs> if you haven't seen the last video, I recommend that you go back and watch it. Not just because it's a good one and a funny one, guys, but it's also one that we talk about our merch giveaway. It's going to be happening real soon. I don't know exactly the exact date, maybe the end of this month or whatnot, but it's a long overdue delay. Three lucky winners are going to win either the chance at merch or some of RBG's box set 12 years of entertainment DVD. The first two winners can either have a choice at one or the other, and uh, another person can get a choice at both. So there's going to be one big giveaway winner who's going to get one of each. You can choose your design, or I'm over here. Hey, what's up with that, man? Hmm? Maybe you're making noises. Now you're done. I'm done making noise, daddy. Anyway, like I said, if you haven't watched the last vlog, I talk about it in there. But if you can't go back, the giveaway is as simple as this. You comment below on not this video, but the last video, and um, you have a chance to enter a giveaway at some merch with a DVD box set, guys. And I only have a limited supply left, so if you don't win, you can buy the box set for 50 bucks, but other than that, once they are gone, they are gone, guys. They are gone. And that's all I gotta say about that. I think my mom got this ball pit for me, not for my son. Go, my son just joined me. What do you think, Dutch? Yeah, no words. No words to say on the matter. No comment. Oh, where are you going, Dutch? You leaving the party? Leaving the party? He's like, oh, you caught me dead. No, I wasn't going nowhere. What are you talking about? Ah! 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 Yeah. So I just had the most random thing happen earlier today on Instagram and it was just blowing my mind because I don't think views and likes and all that stuff really matter, but I've never had anything blow up like this within an hour, man. I've got literally almost 3,000 views. I don't know if you can see that there or not, but screenshot it if you can't, but boy, oh boy, I did not expect. And if you want to see that video, you're going to have to just go to my Instagram. So hold up. While we on the topic of Instagram, let's talk about Instagram. So yeah, my Instagram account that I've had of like 10 plus years has been hacked. Who would have thought? First off, it's a dead giveaway. Why would I change it to BG Studio AA? AA has nothing to do with it. And the R is gone. The heck happened? Yeah, RBG right there. It's a dead giveaway. A lot of my pictures were saved on Facebook, so it's okay. It's a bummer. And it's kind of sad to see all your memories from the last, you know, 
decade just taken over by someone else. And it's just like, okay, you pretend to be me, but you ain't me. Also, if you wouldn't mind reporting my original account, it'd probably help. If I lose my stuff, I lose my stuff. But if I can get my account back, that's cool too. I entered in a giveaway, right? So a giveaway is a false spam giveaway. It tricked me. And then next thing you know, my account's hacked. And I'm logged out. And I was just like... I try to keep trying to log back in. Well, let me log back in. Next thing you know, I created a new account. You can find me at Real RBG Studios. That way, it's like you know, it's the real me. It's like don't think it's misspelling, guys. I'm not. It's not misspelled. Then they say, hey, you know, make this video for us. We'll give you your account back. So I made this stupid video, claiming everything to be real. And it's not. And then boom, they like, oh, okay, thanks. And then they blocked me and all that crap and then they ended up uploading the video so it looks real and it's not me i was completely tricked and duped it happens to the best of us i just gotta, gotta live with it move on just lost a social media account it's okay i create a new one it's all good back to the content Papa's gonna hit you with a little bit of distraction for uh, talking about courage and choosing it. You don't have to go far to find an inspirational quote on courage. Courage starts with showing up and letting ourselves be seen. The frame of mind that has been packaged so much that we sometimes need a reminder that scrolling by a quote on courage on your Instagram feed, speaking of, <laughs> and, and sharing it because it's wholeheartedly agreeable with it is not the same thing as taking a courageous action. I'm not saying you need to be climbing mountains or you don't even need to be doing one thing every day that scares you. Some people say if your dreams aren't big enough, they don't scare you, but you don't have to be doing something every single day that scares you. What I'm saying is that living courageously requires us to do something. It is just as much about the quiet and unseen decisions that we make daily as it is about comforting the bigger goals we set throughout our lives. You see, courage is not present when life is easy. And we don't need courage to hear positive feedback about how we're doing or to take it stock of our lives when everything seems to be in its place. We need courage when things get hard. When we want to give up, but need to keep going, we need courage when we fail or make a mistake. And when life delivers us a set of circumstances we did not order during our last online shopping spree, there's a common misconception that courage occurs independently in its own right. It doesn't. Courage doesn't show up unless you need it so if you need yourself safe from emotional discomfort, wrapped up in warm mental courage appears so that you may go ahead and truly start living. You may be waiting a very long time and, and find that you're stuck before you've even started. So you see, courage is right there beside you when fear is loudest. Rejection is nipping at your heels and shame is ready to know the risks, but we do it anyway. When we say to ourselves that living authentically is more important than staying comfortable, that's where you'll find courage. So you know that thing you have to give to the world? Put it out. Please take the step and trust that courage will show up. Doing so is the only way we live fully, richly, and deeply. And doing is the greatest gift you can give yourself and the people around you. So choose to live with courage and authenticity because that is true beauty. Join us next time on Positive Thoughts as we choose self-love. That there's gonna bring an end to the video today. Guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, I appreciate the love and support, and we'll see you guys in the next one.